Insulin resistance doubles your risk for a heart attack and stroke, and it triples the odds that your heart attack or your brain attack will be deadly. And that is according to the International Diabetes Federation. Here are five symptoms that can tell if you may be insulin resistant. Stay tuned. What's up YouTube, it's your boy Ed, Everyday Muscle, where it's everyday because building masterpieces don't happen overnight. In this video, we're gonna talk about the symptoms of insulin resistance, if left untreated, how it affects your body, and what you can do about it. If you stay to the end of the video, I'll tell you what I've done to reverse my insulin resistance and to keep my risk low. Symptom one, a large waist. Experts say the best way to tell if you're at risk for insulin resistance involves a tape measure and the moment of truth in front of the bathroom mirror and measuring that waist. If a waist measures more than 35 inches for women or 40 inches for men, you're, the odds of you being insulin resistant are increased. If insulin resistance is severe, you may have visible skin changes. These include patches of darkened skin on the back of your neck, on your elbows, on your knees, on your knuckles, or on your armpits, which is called acanthosis nigricans. Skin tags. A skin tag is a small flap of tissue that hangs off the skin by a connecting stalk. Skin tags are not dangerous. They're usually found on the neck, chest, back, armpits, under the breast, or in the groin area. Skin tags appear most often in women, especially with weight gain and in elderly people. PCOS, or polycystic ovarian syndrome. There are links between insulin resistance and PCOS. The symptoms of PCOS can include irregular menstrual cycles, infertility, and periods that cause pain. Currently, there's no known true cause of PCOS. However, there are associations with excess insulin and low-grade inflammation and genetics that cause PCOS. Vascular disease. An individual with high levels of insulin in their blood will also have an increased risk of vascular diseases, such as heart diseases, even if they don't have diabetes. So there are complications with insulin resistance, if left untreated especially. If metabolic syndrome goes untreated, you can have high blood sugar, severe low blood sugar, a heart attack, a stroke, kidney disease, eye problems, cancer, or Alzheimer's disease. If in doubt, or you have any of the issues mentioned before, please consult your medical physician. Insulin resistance is preventable and reversible. So I hope that information was helpful. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share this information with anyone who may find it useful. This is Ed for Everyday Muscle. Masterpieces aren't built overnight. We're in it for the long haul. Be safe out there. Peace. Click here for other videos about insulin resistance.